Our department is comprised of three complementary disciplines, biostatistics, epidemiology, and informatics. And those three disciplines bring together unparalleled leadership and expertise. The mission of the department is to develop and apply state-of-the-art methods and study designs to improve our understanding of disease and health in individuals and in populations. And that's what's so exciting about being part of this department, to be part of this group of people who are always trying to innovate and to meet the challenges that emerge on a daily basis. Translational research is at the core of everything we do, bridging the gap from theoretical knowledge to data-driven insights to improve our knowledge for patients, populations, and communities, and really improve public health outcomes. We create the toolbox, the framework, the analytical methods for pen medicine to function at the forefront of biomedical research. With the explosion of data, our department is integral part of the mission of pen medicine to disentangle complicated data to answer the questions clinicians and their patients have about their health. Novel healthcare solutions don't occur in isolation. It requires collaboration and synergy of different types of researchers. This really transforms what we're able to do in terms of data-driven insights and changing the landscape of patient care. From data to action, we are able to understand what's happening in the world and make recommendations about how to improve what's happening in the space of biomedical research and health sciences. Some of the things that are really exciting include developing studies and methods around precision health to develop treatments and strategies to prevent some of the disease from happening in those communities. Another goal of the department is to reduce health disparities. It requires an array of expertise from individuals with different backgrounds who understand access to care, economics, and how do we develop methods to answer very complex issues. The work that's being done at Penn Medicine is cross-cutting. And that's what excites me about it. There's always something new to think about, always new challenges to take on. AI is going to be transformational in improving patient outcomes, specifically by making the jobs of physicians and nurses more efficient and more effective. Doctors and nurses who use AI are going to replace doctors and nurses who don't use AI. Our department is an exciting place because we have such a variety of expertise, from people who do computer algorithms that are so sophisticated, to clinicians who think about how to treat their patients and what they need. I'm absolutely in awe with our trainees, our postdoctoral fellows and our students. They're the future generation, and it's been an amazing opportunity to train them, to work with them, to learn from them. And that's absolutely special about our department. You need basic scientists, and clinicians to work together to make those discoveries that are really transformational. We can truly do this bench to bedside and back to the bench just seamlessly through collaborations at our institution. Science works on both ways. It goes from the bench to the bedside to the populations and in reverse order as well. In pen medicine, breaking silos is not a slogan, it's a reality. Our ability to monitor patients using sensing technology, the developments in AI and machine learning, all of those innovations are happening here in our department. Learning health systems are the future of how healthcare should be done. And the basic concept is that we learn from what we do in healthcare, and then we do what we've learned to try to make an impact in improving human health, which is the goal. That's what we're trying to do.